What's happening guys? Welcome to Stuffy Tech, I am Eugene, bringing you some updates. Boy oh boy, Nvidia must be sweating right now. Not only are they having a very pressured launch of the RTX 3080 and 3090 GPUs with cards selling out globally, now they have to deal with AMD bringing out GPUs that are competing and maybe even a little bit better than what they've just launched. The RX 6900 XT already showed in some leaked benchmarks that it can outperform the RTX 3080, which is remarkable by itself. But now there have been even more leaks suggesting that the RX 6800 XT can beat the RTX 3080 GPU in synthetic benchmarks. Not only was this confirmed by one source, but by three individual sources claiming that the new RX 6800 XT can really give a punch back to the RTX 3080, actually only losing in ray tracing. The RX 6800 XT beats the RTX 3080 in three out of six benchmarks, offering fairly similar performance in two and losing in the ray tracing centric port ray hell, just by a little bit. Some leaks have also shown that the custom Asus ROG Strix RX 6800 XT is able to boost beyond 2.5 gigahertz, which is absolutely incredible. Nvidia could be in real trouble here. They've already launched products that allegedly are inferior to what AMD is bringing to the table. Nvidia are having massive supply chain issues with their 3080 and 3090 graphics cards into the hands of gamers. And the problem here is that gamers will have money in hand to spend on a graphics card and they won't be able necessarily to buy an RTX 3080 graphics card. When AMD comes around and you know, you get that itch that you want to scratch to buy a new graphics card, you might just spend it on an AMD graphics card instead. Nvidia, you are in trouble for real this time around. AMD has never been able to launch a graphics card that is able to compete head up to head like it's been. <laughs> AMD has never been able to compete with Nvidia head to head like this. And Honestly, I'm getting excited because it was multiple sources saying the same thing. So chances are this is very real and very true and that we are in for one heck of a ride in two, three days from now when they actually launch these cards and we can actually see them in games by reviewers. So if you like this video, click that like button, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Also, next time I'm doing my own PlayStation 3 from scratch. Yes, building it myself. So you don't want to miss that. Awesome. Cheers, guys.